Hello everybody, welcome to Reading Zero. My name is The Darkfire, and today we're going to be quickly running through how to install Minecraft on the modern version of React OS. I'm going to quickly make a React OS VM here, and so you know we're doing this the authentic way. Okay. Basically, just an overview of you. We're going to end up putting OpenJDK on the desktop, multi MC, linking it together. That's about it, really. It's not too hard, not too stressful. Works pretty well, as honestly. I'm personally going to install Mesa 3D as that makes things a little more stable on the graphics front. You can try using whatever graphics you have. I think there's like four different ways to handle OpenGL stuff in React OS at this point, so. But don't quote me on that because I don't really know. I'm gonna try and do this in like one go. We'll see. I'm kind of tired and I stream in like not very long. <laughs> so, all right, we're gonna need to insert guest editions. Okay. All right. So, I'm gonna go ahead and install a couple extra things, like I said. Um, ooh, not that. I'm personally using VirtualBox, as installing VirtualBox stuff is pretty simple. Oh, well, I say that, but it's gonna fail on me. Holy shit. <laughs> nice! Uh, that's fine. <laughs> Forget it. We don't need it. Alright. So. Personally, the way I do this is I use Mesa 3D. And I'm just gonna get Firefox real quick. Yep. Installing Mesa 3D, completed. I'm gonna get Firefox. You can see we're using the latest version or build or whatever as of right now. I mean, in 10 minutes it's gonna change knowing React OS, but you know what? It's fine. Okay. I'm, we're gonna go to a website, search multi MC. First, we're going to solve a CAPTCHA, CAPTCHA, or whatever. You're going to see my failing CAPTCHA skills, because I'm not very good at that, to be honest. And sorry, I might sound kind of boring again. I have to start streaming in, like, a couple hours, so. Oh, there we go. I already failed. <laughs> nice. Oh my god, it's so painful. Okay, there we go. Okay, multimc.org. You're just gonna scroll down, download for Windows. It looks like it's Windows 10, but it runs on this just fine. Then you're gonna search open JDK Java 8 download. It's gonna have a whole bunch of options. OpenJDK.net is probably your best bet. Um, we need the binaries there. Oh wow, this is being a little slow. While that's loading, I'm gonna go ahead and extract this onto the desktop. Extract all, yep. Show extracted files. You can run multi-MC set it up it doesn't really matter i can increase this a little bit um you don't have a java setting so just proceed without java finish and then you're good all right now we need to get our java gre but firefox is going to be a little obnoxious about it so Okay, <laughs> there we go. That sucks. Okay, open JDK. Shall we hit download? Try again. We'll try this one this time. Yep, that's the one. Job JDK Java.net, I believe. Java 8, software implementation. Windows 10, it says Windows 10, but this is one of those times where it's gonna work on React OS just fine doesn't it's not really gonna give you any problems 
All right, I'm gonna go ahead and log in really quick. It's just the normal Minecraft login stuff. You need a Mojane account for this. I'm not gonna say it right. Oops, close. I'm logged in and then Java's ready. Extract this, extract all, next. You can get rid of whatever browser you're using to download this crap. You can finish. Now, create an instance. I personally am going to use 1.8.9, but you can use pretty much any Minecraft version. I just like 1.8.9 for the sake of stability. Go to settings, Java installation, browse. Find where you extracted OpenJDK, go to bin, JRE bin, and select Java W, and then launch. And at that point, Minecraft should launch. You should have a pretty stable version, and honestly, just enjoy. I'm gonna go ahead and make sure it launches here real quick gonna take a second because it can be a little slow on my internet connection but it's all right in a VM this works fine uh, yeah all right there you go that's Minecraft on react OS thank you all for watching I hope each and every one of you has an absolutely wonderful night goodbye